What's up guys, Juggalo23451, and I've been playing with this handy dandy little gadget here, the Og Gen or Ogen uh, Gen Touch 7 8, 7 inches for the screen and 800 megahertz processor. I'm thinking that's why they did that. But anyway, um, got some comments saying people, oh, they don't like this product, blah 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 blah, saying you have to push real hard for um, to be I guess sen touch sensitive it really sucked well they came out with an update calibration update for the screen so let me show Ta-da! see look does it look like I'm pushing that hard of course I'm doing this trying to see the webcam see it identifies it then I let go and I'm actually shuts it so you to open this you can slide it or you just hold your finger like two seconds pops open. Okay, let's uh, do the web browser. Hold. Okay, see it highlights it and then you just uh, hold it for like two seconds and it should pop up, you know. I don't know why people are complaining about it. So, I don't know. Pretty cool little gadget, I think. So, alright. And uh, here I pulled up something off of the YouTube's or internet web, excuse me. That right there is FFG51. It's the USS Gary. Uh, but uh, let me try to pull up something off the internet if I can get it on here. All right. I'm gonna. All right. One second. need to have it here. Let me see something if I can do something a little interesting so you guys can actually see it. Alright, I'm going to adjust my webcam where it's pointing down. And maybe you might be able to see it or I'm not sure. So, And it should be bringing up YouTube.com. And it's fairly responsive, as I said. I don't know why people say it sucks unless they first got it and they didn't have the updates then, but they have them now. See, you try to do it. Keep in mind, I'm all looking at my webcam. Click that. See? And then click this right here. And then you hit the center of the screen to play, just like with any other Android. And should be loading up soon, hopefully. What's up, guys? Turbo 23451. And today I got the uh, login uh, Gen Type 7 inch Ethernet tablet. Okay. I'm just proving to a point whoever said the touch stuff. The touch feature, the touch screen is not sensitive. They're apparently wrong because all you have to do is update it. If you're not tech savvy and don't know how to up the, update the thing, then don't get stuff. You know, you can't if you don't know how to use your computer. Just push the power button, and that's all you know how to do. Don't get an Android product. You know, everybody expects something to be perfect the first time, and that that's what I think. Uh, Walmart shoppers did, or not Walmart, but Kmart, excuse me. Because they're all like, oh, it's going to be so great. And then they come up with updates and they don't know how to update the thing. And they came out, as I said, with the calibration update. And um, let me bring it up right here. Like they, they have um, like an app store update. And then they have a SD and USB driver for 32-bit and 64-bit. You know, they have an ES File Explorer update. And um, I have to actually find a link where I got it from. But there's another thing where they, like, updated the whole system, like the volume and the touch, not the calibration tool, 
whatever that I downloaded, but a whole bunch of other things as well. So I'm going to go ahead and show a history, and then I'm going to try to find it real quick. And then if I can't, it's going to be SOL, I guess. So I'm trying to look, trying to look. Uh, I can't find it. I'll put it up on my link on the YouTube page when I find it. But I guess that's it. Comment, subscribe, rate this video, and have a good day.